Hello everyone, it's Janet here with another design team project for Wild Orchid Crafts and the Wild Bunch. And most of you that watch regularly know that I love to wrap packages and I'm getting ready to send my swap partner her package. It was the tea time swap. So I just wanted to show you um, a couple of things and then how I have wrapped everything. So she wanted her colors to be in the pinks and cream, so that's what I did. And I did make her a cupcake also and um, similar to very similar to the ones I've made before um, using Wild Orchid Craft goodies. This is some of the Gapur lace and I'll put the product codes to everything down below. And these are some of these delicate little mixed color wild roses. And then I have another one of the baby pink tone roses. And then I have a cameo from my stash. And then I have one of these ivory mulberry tea rose buds right there. And then I have some stick pins in there. And on the top, I have used um, Wild Orchid Crafts. Um, the Baby Pink Organza Rose Trimming. This is the large trimming, and that's what I used all on the top. And boy, doesn't that look like a nice confection. So I made her that, and then we were supposed to do a 6x6 six six page. So I did this page using some more of this beautiful lace netting that is new to the store. And then this little pink rose, which is the Baby Pink Wild Rose Two-Tone. And I have some seam binding on there and some little sweetheart blossoms. And then I just have some teapot tags in here that I've tied with seam binding and a little charm. And I've used vellum on the top and I stitched around the corner edges of it. And then the back is that paper there. And then on the other side, I used these pieces from this lace right here. This is the Gapur Lace too. I use these pieces as my corners. And I left this part so that they can put the picture in the center. Have a tea party banner up there at the top. Some vintage lace from my stash there. And then I have some velvet ribbon back there too. So that is my six by six page. And then of course I had to gift her with some wild orchid craft flowers. I mean, it's just an essential. So I packaged them up in this clear box. And I did put paper on the back so that you couldn't see the stems part. And when I put them in, I put the stems down. And this is a piece of vintage off-white lace from my stash. Some tulle. Another beautiful Wild Orchid Craft pink and white small curly wild rose in the center. And you can see how just a little ribbon or a little tool and one of the Wild Orchid Craft flowers. It just makes a beautiful package and the presentation is so nice. And then this little trim is from my stash as well. So she gets that and then I decoupaged a napkin on this glycine bag for this one. A little seam binding and another flower up here. So that's that. And then I have this cone, I don't know if you can see it here, that I wrapped in this beautiful fabric I got from Joann's. And I had planned to put it somewhere in the project, but this is, I just ended up, and then she can use this piece of fabric when she's done. Piece of um, lace, I think I'd gotten this from Juliana, and another flower. So that's very beautiful. And then I made her a card, and this is just a shape of a teapot that I got off my Cricut cartridge. I think it was from Ashlyn's Alphabet. Put some vintage pink up here with a little pink rickrack and a bling. Another cameo and a teapot from Melissa Francis. Some more of the flowers and this is that same lace that I used on the corners of the 6x6 page. And then a little bit of ribbon for a flower. So that and it opens up but I have a message inside so I won't show that. And then this is the box that I'm going to have the cupcake go in. And as you can see it just takes a regular Chinese takeout box. Um, and put a piece, a little bow on the top with one of Wild Orchid Craft Flowers and it just makes it very beautiful. So that's what the cupcake will go in. And then I have just another bag here that I just decorated with some stickers. And then that's the cigar box that I will show you a video after she gets it. I am so pleased with it. But that's that all wrapped up. And then this is her teacup all wrapped up. So anyway, thanks everyone so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. Bye!